Hey, what's up? So I'm going to do a collective energy read for September 18th through the 25th, 2024. This is for whatever comes out. I've already shuffled. Well, let me do a couple more shuffles. First card I got is the Knight of Cups in reverse. The warrior carries a cup with an important elixir of cure to be delivered where it is needed, regardless of the challenges. Symbolism. A figure rides a horse that is walking on water. They are on a quest to find their passion and purpose. Reverse, possessive, and clingy. Two came out. I got the Eight of Spears and the Moon in reverse. Let me read the Eight of Spears first. Use your skill and experience to improve your financial status and your security. A powerful figure exertly juggles a spear, showing his mastery of the process of right craftsmanship and expertise. And then the moon in reverse, 18. The moon represents the feelings we need to explore and express. The moon as an archetype is the 18th encounter for the fool. It illuminates our deepest feelings so we can understand the emotional framework that gets reinforced, suppressed, and shaped by our family and close relationships. Symbolism. The phases of the moon represent the changing emotions humans experience as part of a numerous cycles, both monthly and yearly. Reverse, delusional, nightmares, negative emotions, and despair. So what I'm seeing so far, you've probably been reflecting on things that were emotional triggers throughout your life. You've learned where, where they originated from, um, how you have held on, on, on to these emotional triggers throughout your lifetime but now you are letting go because now you know how to balance it so you seem to empower yourself with balancing your mind you could have had people triggering you at work family members that trigger you um, you feel very conscientious of decisions you make you probably used to really second guess yourself because you were worried about what others would think. And. Yeah, it seems like you're a pastor now. Something that you have mastered. Let me see. I'm going to pull at least three more cards or see if something pops out. See what else is the collective need to know. I got the Ten of Wands in reverse. The King of Swords upright. And the Queen of Cups in reverse. Ten of Wands. It is time to say no and set limits. You do not have enough energy right now. Symbolism, ten wands casting shadows on the other side of rough terrain. Let the figure know that the journey will be difficult. Reverse exhaustion and oppression. Okay, King of Swords. I hope I said that right. King of Swords. You will see the decision and do not need input from others. Make your choice and inform everyone else 
once you have decided, you may be called to negotiate a dispute. Symbolism. The wise face of an elder hovers above a single sword. He is in the symbol of decisiveness. Upright, the final decision maker and judge. Then lastly, I got the Queen of Cups. Queen of Cups in reverse. You need to act with conviction regarding a significant relationship. Symbolism, a female figure with octopus tentacles at the bottom of her card and a cup balanced on her head representing her ability to commit and balance emotional situations. Reverse, passive aggressive and overly sensitive. So again, it seems that you have gotten over past relationships, things that have triggered you emotionally. You have now uh, empowered yourself by understanding your own self, not blaming other people by thinking that, you know, if you see these people, you're going to get triggered or it's not them. It's you. Uh, the things that were triggering you was you looking at the past, remembering the past, comparing the past to the present, even probably comparing people, people from the past to people you know now. And you realize that was keeping you stagnant. It wasn't allowing you to move forward. And you had to realize that was yourself. Only you can stop yourself from worrying, judging, looking backwards, or even comparing. Um, you realize these new phases and these new emotions that you're going through, you realize there is a whole terrain that you have not explored yet. And you're actually looking forward to new beginnings. And somehow it is, you are recognizing that it is empowering you. Like you feel like you have all this new wisdom and energy because uh, you have a new place to be. You have new places you want to go, new places, new things you want to explore, and you're no longer holding on to the past. And that's pretty much all I got. I'm going to holler at you guys later. Please like, share, subscribe, and leave comments. Watch Putting Things Into Context on YouTube at 369 Dimension Readings. Subscribe now. Hey, you want to turn up the volume on your medical cannabis wellness journey, but don't know how? You want the ease of getting the products you need delivered to your front door? Then follow these three easy steps. Step one. Go to NugMD.com, your portal to a hassle-free path to medical cannabis. Answer a few quick questions and see if you qualify for a medical recommendation letter. It's a remix of convenience and ease. Don't worry, you only pay if you're approved. Step two, congratulations. You're approved and armed with your medical recommendation letter. Now, you can use the official 369 Music Talk Health link to sign up and make your first purchase. Step three, head over to Hire.Health, your go-to destination for premium cannabis essentials. From soothing strains to focus-boosting blends, they've got the beats covered. Turn up the wellness, turn up the creativity. Visit NugMD.com and Hire.Health today. NugMD.com and Hire.Health, your rhythm to wellness unlocked. For video editing, shorts, thumbnails, and business card design, contact 369admingroup at gmail.com. Baby, you know where to so when you need a fresh clip, want the head to slow. Fly back, we bobble down just to place to see. And always feel GDA where you feel so free. So give them a call or just stop by. Fly back, we bobble down, let them get.
get you fly With that 808 beat and the vibe so live You leave with a smile and a stylist style Fly factory barber lounge, they'll treat you right you to go on ahead and check out and then if you should so feel subscribe to my live channel of the hotel 333 as that is where we do our live reads all right let's see what y'all got going on <laughs>